how do you add some urgency to your emails when you want people to um, act on something in a in a given time frame? I found these countdown timers for emails are a really great way to do that. And I use Countdown Mail, which is up here, um, countdownmail.com. And uh, I only use the free version and I use it to embed countdown timers in my emails. So how do you do that? Well, you click on create timer and you can see uh, a little template pops up. And what we want to do first is put in our time. So um, let's say, for example, uh, I'm hosting a webinar on the 16th of August and it's going to start at 11 a.m. And that's my time set. So I've got 30 days and counting till the webinar. I'm going to title the webinar uh, and I'll put email tips webinar. And I want the language to be in English and my time zone is great. So it is GMT. So that's brilliant. I'm only going to use the standard um, timer. So you can see that's changed there. And now you can go into design it. So you can change your um, font styles and um, what, you, what you show once the countdown timer is up. So you can show zeros or you can show an expiration message. So it will say this offer has expired or you can say uh, this webinar is uh, this webinar is over and it will show that once that timer has expired and then what you want to do is set your colors so you've got your um, primary color and it's solid the background and um, so you've got various things here and you can set your colors to your brand colors so um, i'm going to just pick um, one of my brand colors which is this lovely pink and i'm going to set it at that and that's oh that's not where, where I wanted to go. Uh, the background colour is this. So that should set the background colour amazing. And I want the primary colour to be white. I want people to be able to see that. That's as close. Um, and I want this text to be lighter as well. So it can be seen. There you go. So you can read that on the um, timer. Now these, these two things are paid for um, features, which I don't use, and the advanced options, you can set the label positions and whatnot, but we're not going to mess with that. We're going to go with this. And what we want to do now is save that timer. Now, what that gives you is this embed code. Now to put it in your email, what you have to do is to copy this portion of it all the way up to so from starting from http all the way up to gif and you want to copy that and then you create an email um so i'm just going to create an email i'm going to choose a template quickly that will help me demonstrate how this works um so uh, let's just pick a layout template and let's pick this one because it's got a nice big image at the top that we can put this into. So this email will come up. And what you want to do once it's arrived is click on this image, select replace, and then head to this spot, this feature here, image URL. And you paste that URL into that space and then you hit preview and you can see that that um, you are that uh, countdown timer has come up and when you hit insert that will insert it into your email and that's how you get a countdown timer in your email that helps people understand the urgency of what you want them to do and you want them to respond.